so I think we've all been there, had a bit too much for mozzarella cheese or whatnot, and we've clogged up the toilet. So we've got three different plungers here. Uh, three different plungers do work to an extent. Um, if we want to pick one that's not really meant for it, uh, we're picking this one. So I've seen some people try to fluke it through. Uh, usually it ends up in a pile of shit, but um, so this one's just mainly for basin and sinks. It's not for those uh, heavier duty sort of sort of clogs in the toilet. So um, we'll just get rid of that one for now. Um, so we'll look at the this sort of push vacuum system first. Uh, you can get this from any warehouse or anything like that for about $20. Uh, it literally just um, holds in the water and with the air or thrust, you're pushing through the water or air and that gets rid of the obstruction. Secondly, we've got this rod. Um, as a plumber, I like to prefer to use this a lot more. Um, as you can tell, a lot further away uh, from the toilet, so a splashback uh, to a minimum and uh, it works the same sort of way except you're sort of using your physical force rather than the push thrust force. All right, let's demonstrate how these uh, two bad boys work, eh? Okay, as you can see here is uh, one that someone's prepared earlier for us. Um, if your system for some reason isn't working as well, so if the water keeps rushing through, you've got that isolation there. So quickly just turn that off and then you can get plunging. All right, let's see how this goes. So if you push a little bit of force there, you can see that there's a bit of toilet paper left, but that. And there it goes. So it didn't go the first time, but as you can see, it's just pushing the, uh, the blockage through. Um, as you can see, fully blocked, just using the force and you're just pressurizing it through. And after a couple of hits, it'll escape. So, I'll just show you that it's worked. Everything's back to normal. Thanks for tuning in to Pete's Plumbing. I hope this showed you what to use and, and how to use it. And uh, please leave any comments if, the, if you get stuck or um, please subscribe. All right, thank you very much.